when I um when I flew from Denpasar, I had to go from Denpasar to Doha to Berlin, and my layover chat on the way back was eleven hours. Eleven hour layover. Finally have a home again, XTD. Oh my! I sat in the airport for eleven hours. That uh, was fucking cat despair. What is this? Top three double jump scare. What is a double jump scare? This guy didn't build a very deep burrow. Oh my god! What the fuck? What the fuck? Yo! What the hell, man? I completely forgot about that dog shit. What the fuck? That was kind of scary. Oh my, oh my god, god. well what the fuck is that clip? Yo! <laughs> Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on you. Fool me three times, shame on me. What the fuck is that? Why don't you put the jump scare at the end? I didn't even know what that was. It just says what the fuck is that? Bro, you're so kinda of fucking tired. Fuck, why am I tired? Kids game has mark shaking. What is that? How old is that clip? How old is that clip? Where is he come from, buddy? Oh! <laughs> How old is that clip, man? How old is that clip? World 2020 group stage, it says that doc. What the fuck? I was there. Were you actually? Oh, Aglan, maybe you were there, actually. Farewell. My morning usually started with casual streams, but after MSI, I took a vacation. I have to improvise. I managed to finish my bachelor's degree and even found a job in marketing. I don't know how, but I even got laid. Because after a long time, I managed to spend my Friday not watching NEC, but going to a bar. I never thought that one week could change my life so much. It was a good run. With love, x -Red. Let's go. Recall. The Demon King calls. Worry not, I'll be love back. You, my rat king. What? I guess Faker is Ari's canon husband. Wait, really? Is Faker Ari's canon husband? Oh, the fucking phone. What is this? Rat army official XTD hand rat. gesture sign. If we ever see each other IRL, just use this sign to show how frauds we are. Man, listen, cut me some slack, okay? I just flew for nine oh, hours. Let's go, man. And then I slept in an airport for 11 hours. Hell ye, and then I just got on the plane for the next flight for eight hours or some shit, okay? Listen. I'm completely cooked. You were flying first class? No, I was flying business class. Because I said, listen, I've got 500 bucks. Should I spend it on Ari or a nice chair? I went for the nice chair. Yo, much love, man. I'm glad you finished university. That's crazy. That's crazy that you finished university, man. Congrats. Glad the rats could help. G2 Caps' contribution to the faker Halo Blades, uh, the Hall of Legends skin. The Cactus Gift, bro. What I will say is Riot did a really good job on this skin in the amount of references it has. It has so many references, this skin. It has so many like random references of Faker's YouTube dances and all this shit. Aurora, new champion, who is a Vestaya, relates to Bunnies and Orin's friend, probably a mid or top laner. He better be a mid laner. But it would be a bit weird if she's a mid laner, no? What was the most recently released champ? Looking Wasn't forward it? to the trans dimensional pace. Wasn't it Thanks Hui? for the entertainment. Didn't they just release Hui? So what are they going to do? Release Hui and then another mid? Yeah, it's really well designed, this whole skin. But, uh... <laughs> Rat th King throwing out gang signs in Indonesia. No, I'm not. The sentiment on Reddit rarely matches the perception of the average person. The majority of League players are casual players. Most players probably don't even know about Vanguard or why it sucks. They just want to play the game. I imagine the amount of people who dropped the game after the addition of Vanguard isn't statistically significant. We are comparing to how many people dropped the game on average. They dropped a $500 skin because they did number crunching analysis of how well their past overpriced $100 to $200 chromas and skins have performed. The results indicated that the outrage would be worth the cost of doing business. Listen, the biggest problem, the biggest problem with this faker skin is like the oh, reason I think go, man. they're milking faker's name a bit too much is, hey, let's release a skin where you can like the counter argument is. Well, the skin actually is only really 40 bucks if you want to buy the base skin. Sure, you can buy the base skin for 40 bucks. Still pretty expensive for 40 bucks, but sure, you oh, can use that counter go, argument. Man. But it has no reference to Faker at all, really, does it? Single it doesn't have any of the animations, back, any of the GFX, anything. It has nothing. 
It has no transformation, no real huge big relation to it. But the main thing is, let's say you're uh, the fourth person to join the Hall of Legends four years from now, okay? How do you keep it up? What are you going to do? The only thing you can do is release an Uzi Vein skin for 500 bucks to keep up the trend. And then it's just off from there. Like, I love Mata. I love Deft. These are great players, so I think could be in the Hall of Legends. But you're not going to sell their skin for 500 bucks. They're just not that guy, you know? They're just not... It, it just... It just... It, it doesn't hit. Faker is the only one who can pull this off. It just sets a bad precedent to everyone else. It's like, hey, we're going to sell Faker skin for $500. Yeah. Uzi will do it for 450. Listen, Mata, I know like you're cool at Thresh and shit. We're, we're gonna have to do like maybe $99 max. Well, it's, it's just like, bro, it's just weird. Like, come on, man. Just, it just sets a bad precedent. It just sets a bad precedent. Listen, Deft, like you're fucking cool and shit. We'll make an Ezreal skin for you. Have to be about $105, $106. That's all we can push here. No one's gonna, like, I don't get it. LCK is considering Fearless Draft next year. Bro, I think the future of League is Fearless Draft. It is. The future of League of Legends is Fearless Draft. Pog. Wait, is Challenger... Wait, hold up. Hold up, hold up. LCK Challengers. Are they doing Fearless Draft or not? Are they doing Fearless Draft or not, LCK Challengers? They are, but they're doing soft Fearless Draft, right? They're not doing hardcore. Right? No, they're doing hardcore? Wait, is LPL doing hardcore as well? Or is LPL doing soft? What's the difference between hard and soft? Basically, hard fearless draft is in game one, all 10 champions are banned in game two. So you can't just... And then soft is like, all the champions that I played are banned, you know? So if I play Azir and he plays Corky in hard fearless, in game two, they're both banned. But in game two with soft fearless, I can then play Corky and he can play Azir. And I just fucking hate soft fearless draft because all you do is you just play a comp, they play a comp, and then you swap comps. And it's like great. How much what? Own a pixel is addicted. Addicted to what? Is there someone from the yeah. chat who's like dealing with addicted patients? Hit me up. Give me a call. Give me a call on stream, bro. Let me let me talk about leak. Let me talk about what this shit does to my brain, bro. Jesus. Like right now, I think I'm fixed, but I don't know if I am. I don't know if I am, bro. Right now, I don't want to play it. But what about tomorrow morning? Nobody knows. <laughs> gee, gee. Look at look at my Twitch recommendations. Look at this. Look at this. Fifteen months. Christmas. Look what it's trying to do to me, bro. Four cents. Live channels. Four cents a really good lead stream. We should you think you like? How does it? Four cents on leak? Nine, 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 nine. Not interested. Please tell me that fixes it, it. bro. I, I. I Chat, what's his OPGG name? I forgot. I don't have it in my recent search. It was like something Stork, wasn't it? What the fuck was his name? That's not him, no way. He is back. What's his name, chat? chat he's not queuing up playing six giants spelled any. He's not that much insane. He's playing on EUNE. Oh, there he is, there he is. Silver 4. Let's have a look. Oh my god, he's in his Tyler 1 arc. He's in his title. He downloaded that fucking AI thing and started playing Elawi. And there's no way. This guy, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, I'm going to take a break three days later. Insta queue up every day. He's playing Arams by himself, man. Fuck. He's getting the mechanic training. Yo, Arams are good for mechanic training. They are good for mechanic training. Gonna practice up. Hey Pedro, just wondering if you'll buy the Ari skin. No, I won't. I will not be buying the Ari skin. I will join the boycott. Oh my god, what is this? Boycott Ari. But I have League Partner, which basically gives me skins. So maybe I'll get it for free. The rich get richer. What the fuck? I don't know, this League Partner thing gives you 5,000 skins. I haven't bought any skins on this account. I have 78 skins that I own. I own 78 skins. But with this, I get 5.7k. So maybe I'll get it. Paul, Listen, we'll do some... Man. Listen, I saw these people. Love these you, people Pedro. on Twitter. These people on Twitter, they're like posting a picture of the Ari skin. And they're like... 
like and retweet this and follow me. I'm doing an Ari skin giveaway. Oh, you're doing an Ari skin giveaway for 500 bucks? Really? Really? Okay, what happens? They're genius. They're fucking genius. You know why they're genius? Because they know Riot's gonna reduce the price. So they're putting it now so that when it reduces to like 200 bucks later, everyone else who's retweeted and followed them already and they've farmed them for followers, he will buy it for them, but it'll be cheaper than it looks like it is now. Clueless, they will reduce it. Bro, if they don't reduce it, you think... Maybe they don't reduce it, but you know, imagine Riot just tank all the backlash, no fucks given, and they just release it at 500 bucks still. Still 200 bucks? Yeah, you know what I'm saying, I just read a number. Do you think... Do you think they just ignore everyone and just keep going? And they send it? 